I'll never forget going in front of about 20,000 people at one of the national tournaments. And I'll never forget running up in Philadelphia the night before weigh-ins. I ran up the stairs. Who's been to Philadelphia? On the stairs where Rocky Balboa ran those stairs, right? You go down to the bottom and there's Rocky, big, big, st big statue. Adrian, right? I was ranked zero going into this tournament. And I said, you got your phone with you? He's like, yeah. I'm like, film me. He grabs his phone as I'm running up the stairs and in the back door, he's like, dun, 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 dun. I ran up the stairs, I got to the top of the stairs, ranked zero in the country, going in for Utah Valley University, brand new program. I turned around over Philadelphia. I said, I'm king of the world. We're gonna do this, we're gonna own Philadelphia. The belief came in way before it could happen. I started winning way before I put my wrestling shoes on. I went in the next day and beat the undefeated guy, ranked number fourth in the country, went on to be Utah Valley University's first ever All-American. And they, they retired my singlet there. <laughs>